During his last night in mortality, the Savior, Jesus Christ, gathered his disciples together for what is known as the Last Supper. At that gathering, the Savior emphasized that his disciples should look to receive his spirit that would replace his presence in their lives. One individual who was at that gathering was John the Beloved, also known as John the Revelator. He later would write in the book of Revelation, I, John, who also am your brother and companion in tribulation and in the kingdom and patience of Jesus Christ, was in the isle that is called Patmos for the word of God and for the testimony of Jesus Christ. I was in the spirit on the Lord's day and heard behind me a great voice as of a trumpet. These words written by John here on the Isle of Patmos were intended to be sent to Christians throughout the Mediterranean area for encouragement and instruction. Reading these words today, I'm encouraged by the teaching that John gives that it's not the physical location that brings peace or solace, but the spiritual. In verse 10, John emphasizes that he was in the Spirit of the Lord. Those words cause me pause and reflection to think, do I live in the Spirit of the Lord? In my daily routines, do I seek to be in the Lord's Spirit throughout my life?